I just want to ask something. You guys have clearly got an incredibly special relationship. Mm. You're business partners now. You're great friends. You've been through the tough times, which we read about a year or so ago. Um, you know, how do you see how do you see your friendship continuing forward as as former rugby players, teammates, and now business partners? Yeah, well, Joe, like you say, we we, we come a long time from 1991. Um, since we've met, um, we, we've actually in the first two or three years, we weren't that close friends. Uh, I think we, we started to get close when after the 95 World Cup, playing together for, um, you know, for, for the free state, for the, for the Springboks. Um, we actually uh, went to the, to the Bulls together for, for one season, one and a half season. And um, then we started coaching and after that in a business relationship. So... Um, we've been good friends. Like you said, we went through a lot um, a year or two ago and uh, uh, we've got a very, very close bond. Um, obviously, he's my best friend and, um, you know, it's, it's an honour to, to have him as a friend. Not because he's a, he's a famous rugby player, but because he's, a, he's an awesome bloke, you know, and a, and a great friend. What, what, what are you missing most about him now in lockdown? <laughs> Well, um, <laughs> one or two red wines, maybe. I'm, I'm yeah. miss, you know, also only gets funny. He's a very quiet guy. He only gets funny <laughs> after about two bottles of red wine. <laughs> and uh, obviously, I'm not allowed to to, to uh, tell anything about those funny stories after <laughs> after two bottles of. of it's an expensive red wine. date. He's on an expensive date. <laughs> two bottles of red wine. Very expensive. Oh, lovely. Well, Naka, thanks so That's much for really joining good. us and. And chatting, mate. It's been great, been great catching up. Also, you're going to um, stay with us as we bring one or two other guys on to, to chat. But now, okay, stay well. Look after yourself. Yourself. Stay safe during lockdown. And most importantly, stay positive. <laughs>